What's up everybody and thank you for joining me for another video. My name is Wack4863, but you can call me Wack. Today I'm going to show you all the new emotes and the pets that they're for and I'll show you the locations as well. Now these are all the emotes that actually made it into the game, the live version update 2.8. So the first emote that we have here is relax and you can see which pets can do that. So we have the hyena, the scorpion, the wolf, the shaleback, the gorilla, the gazelle, the bear. And I did spawn in a few different felines, but most of or all of the felines are supposed to be able to do it. And the undead kappa can actually do it as well. Moving on down the line, we have Sit, and you can see we have an ostrich, we have an undead hyena, we have a wolf, and we also have a regular hyena. The next one in the list is Eat, and you can see we have a hyena, we have a spider, we have a crocodile, and the other crocodile variants, so like the Lacerda are supposed to be able to do this. We have a saber tooth, we have a sand reaper, and we have a wolf. On over here, we have a couple of emotes. So we have the conversation. The conversation has four different styles of conversation. So they are all doing a different style. It's A, B, C, and D. So you can go through those to see which one you like the best. And then here we have working in Anvil and I actually gave her a repair hammer and she is using it. So that is very cool. Actually, when I put the repair hammer in her inventory and then told her to do this emote, she took the repair hammer out and started banging on the table. So that's very cool. Something else that I just want to show you guys is that the skeletons will actually do the emotes as well. So we have conversation here again, A, B, C, and D, and then working an anvil with this guy as well. Now you are not able to set a weapon in these guys inventories because they are pets. So there's no possibility that I can see of having the hammer in the skeleton's hand. Just for funsies, I did go ahead and put a hammer in his inventory and he did not remove that from his inventory to bang on the table. So it looks like he's just pounding his fist against the table. Now, just for the record, your thralls can do any of the emotes that you can do. So any emotes that you've learned, you can go in here and set those emotes. So even if they're ones from DLCs, they are able to do those. The emote locations that I'm going to show you in this video are only the emotes that were added with update 2.8. If you want a complete list of emote locations, go ahead and whack that like button. And if this video gets 500 likes, I'll go ahead and make a video showing you where all those emote locations are. Getting right into the emote locations, the first one that you're looking for is right here at Conan's bar. So you're just going to run inside the bar in Sepa Maru, interact with that, and that's going to give you the four different conversations. The next one that I'm going to show you is up here in the volcano. This is at the Well of Skelos, and you do have to climb up rather high. You will learn the Serpent Man weapons right over there, but this book is right on the edge, and this one is Work Metal. This next one is our first pet emote, and it is right out here in the jungle. You can see the ship down there where you go to the underwater dungeon. Uh, you just want to run up these stairs, run to the middle of this room, and right next to this rubble, you'll interact with this book. That's going to teach you eat for your animals. Also out here in the jungle at the Pagoda of Boundless Lusts, you will find this book. Interacting with that will teach you relax for your animals. The last one on our list here is up in Meadow Watch. This is going to be a book right here. So you can see where I'm at in Meadow Watch. We are right here. Interact with that book to learn sit for your animals. Moving on to the Isle of Sipta, the first book that we're looking for is just outside the camp of the castaways, and it's going to be on this box right next to the camels. If we interact with that, we learn relax for our animals. If we go up into the camp of the castaways, you just want to look for this dancer or performer right here. On the boxes behind him, you will find a book to interact with, and that is going to teach you conversation. Moving all the way down here to the Forge of the First Men, we are at this one of the forges. You can see, there we go, the Forge of the First Men. Right next to that on the ground, you will find this book, and that's going to be Work Metal. 
The next one on our list is just outside the Accursed Citadel. This is the area of broken down buildings, and you can see where I'm at in regards to the tower there. But the book is just laying out here in the open. And when we interact with that, we learn eat for our animals. The last one here is at the Ruins of New Kemi, and it is, it's pretty easy to find. So if you look at all the tents, none of the tents except for this one have stairs. This one does have stairs and a large table inside, and the book is at the end of that table. And if we interact with that, we learn sit for our animals. Now I hope this video has helped you so that you can go out and get all these new emotes for your followers. Get the pet emotes, have a lot of fun with it. Send me some screenshots on Twitter or Discord so I can see how you set up your base with the new emotes. I'd like to thank all my YouTube members for your continued support. Y'all are absolute legends. If you'd like to become a legend, there's a button that says join on this page. Click that for details. There's two videos on the screen. Click one of those to watch next and I'll meet you over there.